About one month ago, I showed a concept for an attachment to a four-way flying machine that reads and writes memory from a two-dimensional plane of blocks. And I couldn't figure out how to do it, so I asked around, and Pingu, another technical Minecraft player, uh, suggested this. So it's a really simple system for reading memory, at least, where uh, you use pistons instead of solid blocks. And what happens is this uh, Siggy piston will pulse once if the piston it's above is down, and will pulse twice if the piston it's above is up. So that's a way to read memory. So I got to work uh, immediately building a four-way programmable flying machine. Uh, it's just about done, by the way, so y'all get a sneak peek of it here. It should be out sometime next week. And sure enough, uh, that's exactly what we used, um, this system right here. But while I was working on it, I stumbled upon a better solution. My original plan was to read memory from the upper half of the pistons and write memory from the lower half, making some weird contraption underneath to uh, send signals under the pistons. And while I was trying to wire connections, so you have, you'd have you have a four-way flying machine above the pistons, a four-way flying machine beneath, and some weird connections going through the uh, piston plane, I tried doing that with this thing, and I discovered a weird problem, which I thought was a problem at the time. It turned out to be absurdly helpful, which is this. The piston itself uh, gets bud powered and ends up moving this whole component upwards. And so we can actually use that to turn this into a memory reader um, by pushing this thing back down so it's reset each time. But when it pops up for that split second, we use it to pulse a four way wire. So I'm going to show this here. This will pulse its wire when it hovers over a uh, piston in the lower position. So if I move it here, it won't do anything. But now when it moves over this piston down here, that wire fires and that lets us read memory from the surface. But here's the super flippin' cool part. You can write memory from the surface too. And so this is, a 2D plane memory reader and writer that can be mounted on a four-way flying machine. I was so excited that I didn't I didn't want to wait until the whole uh, four-way computer was done before uh, showing this thing. That's it for this video, and hopefully I'll see you sometime next week with a four-way flying machine.